As we should first of all find the given data from this statement for calculation of unknown quantities. So in uh, from there I have AC voltage which is 220 volts. This is my first data and frequency. This is my second data which is 50 volts. Furthermore, inductance is represented with capital L and is equal to 10. This is my third data. Demand is inductive reactions which is represented with capital X. And it's hand which is a present with capital I. According to this given data, neither this one is helpful for me nor that one is for calculation of trend because I don't have a uh, maximum value of trend, frequency, time, etc. And this is a, a separate formula for RMS. So these two formulas are negligible for me right now. If I see this formula and that formula, both of these are helpful for me for calculation of trend as well as for calculation of inductive uh, reactance. This is for trend and this is for uh, XL, I mean inductive reaction. So let's use these two useful formulas and find out inductive reactance as well as trend. First part, XL is equal to omega L and I know that omega is equal to 2 pi F multiplied with L. Now I have frequency as well as uh, L which is uh, inductance and uh, I can find inductive reaction, reactance. So let's put values to multiply with pi, multiply with F, F is 50 hertz, multiply with L which is 10. Calculation I get 3140 omega that is value of inductive reactance. Now my demand is I, so let's use this formula for calculation of I. I is equal to V divided by X L. V is voltage which is 220 divided by X L. X L is 3140. I use answer of first part in here. After calculation, I get 0 0.07 ampere. That is... Just a little time